build an AI voice to text Telegram bot in just 3 minutes. I'll show you the whole process from coding to a live demo. For the full code, check out my Telegram channel. Open VS Code. Inside an API folder, create a file named bot.js. This will be our serverless function. We'll start with an async function handler that takes a request and response. We grab the message from the request body. If there's no message, we immediately send back a 200 OK status to keep things clean. Next, we handle the start command. We get the chat ID from the message, define a welcome text that explains the bot's features, and send it back to the user. Now for the core logic. Handling audio. We create a variable that checks if the incoming message contains a voice note, an audio file, or a document that's an audio file. From there, we extract the file ID. If there is no file, we send a message asking the user to send one. Once we have a file, we let the user know we are working on it by sending a transcribing your audio message. To process the audio, we first need to get its path from Telegram's API using the getFile method with our bot token and the file ID. With the file path, we can construct the full URL to download the actual audio file. We fetch this file and convert it into a blob. Here's where the AI magic happens. We are calling the OpenAI Whisper API. We create a form data object and append our audio file and the model name, which is Whisper1. Then we make a POST request to the Whisper API's transcriptions endpoint. The most important part is adding the authorization header with our OpenAI API key. Once Whisper processes the audio, it sends back the transcription. We just parse the JSON response, grab the text, and send it right back to the user in Telegram. And of course, we wrap the whole thing in a try-catch block. If the transcription fails for any reason, the bot will send a friendly error message. Create a helper function that simplifies sending messages. It handles the API call to Telegram, so we only need to provide the chat ID and the message text. To get this online, we need three quick configuration files. Create a vercel.json file to configure our project as a serverless function. Next, create a package.json file to define the project's detail and scripts. Finally, create a .env file and store two secret variables, your bot token from Telegram and your OpenAI API key. With those in place, you can deploy to Vercel. After setting the environment variables in your Vercel project and pointing Telegram's webhook to your new URL, your bot is live. It can now transcribe voice notes in English, Japanese, Arabic, and dozens of other languages. And I don't mind making this speech without a teleprompter, because the teleprompter is not working. <laughs> I feel very happy to be up here with you, nevertheless. How are you in Japanese? Genki? O genki desu ka? Saikin do? How are you in? Bismillah. وعلى بركة الله نعلن عن افتتاح كاس دبي العالمي بدورتها التاسعة عشر 